Um, random. Hello, this is the alligator. We are up here in the uh, lighting, um, lighting gantry uh, for the stuff I've been doing. Um, we put in the safety rails all the way around. Um, so as you can see, you can't go down here because there is a little thing. But then when you open it, you can go down. There we go. And then you kind of just close it behind you like that. It just makes it a little safer. You don't fall down. Go that both sides. Yeah, with the, the rails all the way around, so you would fall into the hole. Um, when you like put lighting up here. Um, we've also had a little play with the with the with the lighting as well. So basically, uh, I've raised it so you can have a little look better at the um, the stage behind. But this is the like the lighting person's desk. So if you press this button, like all the lighting changes, or it would. <laughs> uh, and this is the the, the the sound as you tell by the note block. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's great. Um, so I I put that in. What I will go do now is before I do the set, um, is go put in the um the doobie doos oh yes I, I did this as well this is the um like a little lighting control box um like this is the same room i've just moved things about a bit so that's the workers uh which are now off and we put some buttons just you know and put some signs uh do a rack on the main bar um, I'm gonna go build the uh, the foyers, starting with the upstairs foyer. Right, let's have a look at the upstairs bar. It's nice and simple. Um, we just put a lovely little trapdoor here, and we put some uh, seating, put a little uh, seating there, and a more armchairy kind of look here. Uh, some tables and a little like sofa-y type thing here with a little, uh, little curvy table just there. Put some paintings around. Um, we've also done the bathrooms. They're a bit, they're a little bit tight, but you know this is an upstairs bathroom, so yeah, no. So that's all there. Um, this is a towel. Um, like we. I don't know what to put in, like, of course I would have one of those, like, Dyson Air, um, like, blade things to, because they're the best kind of thing, but I don't know what to do with that, so it's a towel. Uh, yeah, and that's simple, so that's, that's all lovely up here, and we put some lovely paintings around, just so you can, uh, I'm not a great fan of that one. Uh, well, I was thinking about putting some signs kind of around. I think that might look nice. Um, so, like, I'm not entirely sure, but like, this will be like the th something theatre. Like the. And then under each of the paintings will be like the name of the show that it's the poster of. Like, these are posters for shows that have been. Oops. I will come up with some woody names for these. Like, they'll have the, the name of the show and when it ran. I think that'd be nice. Yeah. That will look nice. Okay. Um, so that's all that. Uh, let's go down to the downstairs for you. I, I, I'll build that. It's going to be very simple. Uh, simple? It's going to be very similar to what it's going to be. But we had to put some box office and the other bathrooms. So let's do that. And the downstairs foyer is also done. Yay! Um, so we've just put in some like 
lovely shells for glasses and stuff. In back here we've got like the ice cream fridge, uh, we've got some barrels and places for glasses and bottles and that sort of thing. I really wanted to put in a tap, like get the tap from the bathroom and have it as like an alcohol tap, but for some reason that doesn't work. Uh, that's also not a very good new role. Um, <laughs> use your imagination people. Um, yeah, I was thinking about having a tap, but it has to be on the side of a block. Um, not that this is on grass. You'll never see it. It's not on grass. It's... Oh. <laughs> I've started doing this thing where I've, um, I want to put the purple underlay. Make that block purple. So it matches everywhere else. Yeah, that's pretty. Cool, 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 cool. Um, yep, we've put in the box office. Uh, for some reason it looks a bit off, mainly because that piece of glass is there, but I'm okay with it. Just looking at now, kind of with the face, like, ah, feed me! Okay. Mm. Um, put in the bathrooms. I did realise I put the um, toilets upside down so they look like sinks. So I've changed that everywhere. Uh, yep. I'll open it there. Um, I also did the office. There we go. It's a nice office. Um, yeah, we've got like a little bookcase um, and a uh, filing cabinet. Okay, a filing cabinet. It's blue. <laughs> and we've got the desk for um, like the manager to sit and do things uh, like accounting and budgeting and um, cashing up tills and every lovely thing that they need to do. So we are very close um, to being done. I... yeah, I want red carpet here. I think we've got carpet enough in all the nice places that we can have it here. It just makes it a bit nice, doesn't it? Bit of carpet everywhere. I think that's literally the only place that we don't have it in a corridor right now. That's not either. Like we can have some there. Uh, I'm just going to put these back on the other way, like that way. There we go. I think that's a little bit better. So yeah, I think we're very, very close to being done. Um, surprisingly, because we, I don't think there's anything that we haven't done. Um, yes, we haven't done the, um, like the signs everywhere. Uh, I, I'm going to change these out for birch because I like birch. Uh, uh, I'm just putting these here so they will be here and I have something to click on when I get back here to write on these. I will go do those. The only thing that we haven't done is, because we've done all this, we've done all this, we've done this upstairs bar, we've um, done this, we've done the bathrooms here. Yeah, okay, I can just steal that one. Um, we've done this closet, which holds this scaffolding stuff. Ugh, I don't like that it's brown. I thought about doing brown, but I don't like it. Um, We've done this. Uh, I've changed this out for Birch because I think it's better. Uh, I also just have a little look in here. Put some lights in here. Put a like a, a dimmer rack in here. Um, so there's the lighting person and the sound person. The sound person will literally just run the sound up here from a laptop. Um, it's like so much easier. <laughs> just plug in a like. Box cable and be done. Um, what else? We've done quite a lot of everything. Um, yeah, we've done all the rooms around there. We've done all of that. Um, we've done this. Is this birch? Yes, yeah, birch. So this just needs to be taken out to be birch. It's just a little bit lighter, and I like that. So I'll do that. And then the only thing we have left is the main stage. What we're we gonna put there? Click. 
Ding, 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 Um, oh, good gracious. <laughs> so one of the things I did do was, oops, that doesn't go there, is put the posters outside. And I think these are the posters for what's going in right now. So there's something about fire and there's something about, like, skeletons and skulls. Um, I think the upstairs studio can be the fire one, just because it's like burning bridges and like you have the angsty teenager and that sort of thing and well not angsty but you know unlistened to teenager and the stern like parental figure um so like burning those bridges and that sort of thing which i kind of like uh and then phew, something like deathy kind of dark menacing kind of thing um uh, maybe mistopolis um that's like a like a trickster type of person who uh basically you end up like selling us all to the Mestopheles who is the, the devil. Uh and I think we can use things that are already um back here. So we can use things like the trap door for like that's where like hell is. That's where Mestopheles comes from, so we have that. Um when I did it in university um, we set it in a shopping centre. <laughs> Might not set it in a shopping centre this time. Um, but yeah, I will have a little play with what's going to be on the stage. I think it might be messed up with these or some kind of dark thing. Or maybe we could uh, do something else. I will play and come back. So I've had a little uh, play around with the set, also I did uh, change these all out for Birch, these are all now Birch, um, but we, we didn't do Mestophilies, mainly because I couldn't think of a good idea um, to do, but we did do something slightly death related. We have, for your enjoyment, Sweeney Tot. My arm is complete again. Hello and welcome to the set that is Sweeney Tot. We have Mrs. Lovett's Pie Shop right here. Got some pies here. A little lovely red little one. And one has her little like cutting table. If you'd seen the movie, like, cutting, like, the horrible, like, meat that she's cooking. Um, and upstairs we have the Demon Barber's Fleet Street's shop itself. So this is the chair. Um, this should have a tiny bit of carpet on it, which it doesn't right now. Let's get that. Yoink. There we go. <laughs> So what would happen is you'd you'd be up here, like Sweeney would be up here, like, hello, I'm Sweeney Todd. <laughs> and the, the the person would sit in the chair. Uh, obviously, that, this is my cross, so I can't actually sit. Um, but yeah, so you'd, you'd like, pretend to kill them, like, slice with the razor blade, and then you'd push, like, a little pedal, like, here, and that would, like, make that go back. Actually, it would help probably tip the whole entire chair like backwards um, and then you'd be on the chair and basically you'd fall backwards down this little shoe and you'd slide all the way back down into something like that gets at the end um so yeah that's that's great um we have oof uh we have like joanna's like little apartment over here um, like Judge Turpin would like come through the store and be like, Joanna. Um, I haven't seen him in a little while. Um, here we have the little finch, and uh, like this would be a window, and they could see um, like the uh, the kid who ends up uh, like wooing her. I, I'm not a great fan of like the B plot in Sweeney Todd. It's a bit like meh um, for my liking, um, but that's where that happens. Uh, and he can be out, out here and like that sort of stuff. On this side, we have um, like a little bit for like the Pirelli's uh, Melixa, Melixa? Miracle Elixir um, with little Toby 
um, and things like that. And this could be used for like the insane asylum and things like that. Um, you could also use this for like the ship that they come in, but you can do that with like um, like a prop, like right here at the in the old center. Um, you know, a prop bridge, and then you'd lower like the curtain, or the curtain would be lowered. Uh, and there would just be like a ship with like a mast and a sail and that would be just taken away as the curtains open. So yeah, we've got a little um, picnic bench for when Mrs. Lovitz gets like more popular, when they start using humans. And we've got a, uh, a little alley here with the um, <laughs> alligator uh, with like the curtains, we put in the curtains using these, uh, using the black. It wasn't a waste of time, I tell you. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, this is like a, a little alleyway where like the old woman that can come in and be like, ah, smoke, smoke, terrible, terrible smoke, da 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 da, -da. Um, and all that. Um, and this sort of front area is just kind of like a playing area, which can be used for like lots of things. So like the lighting would go down and this kind of area would be like used for like lots of different things. Um, I was thinking mainly for like like the beginning and like the end, like the climax, um, where they go down to like the basement where like the like the furnaces and that sort of thing and like the sewer. Uh, and I was thinking that you could like pop around like oh we need to go into the basement now. Okay, then pop around this corner, and you could like um, you could run around like the back here like this. Like run, 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 and go through this door, or even just possibly just come straight out here and be like, Toby, Toby. I mean, if it's dark enough, you could be like, okay, we're going to do this stuff and go like, I'm plump, 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 going down the stairs and then just pop out here in the darkness and then come back through the darkness and be like, ah, but like the climax. Um, but yeah, this is it. And, um, we get. I was thinking about using this trapdoor as like it, but I was like, you know, we've got the space for something really big, and like this two-story thing is is great, and like it, you get the height perspective, especially if you're sitting, you know, up here. Like, um, I did like slightly change this as well, but like if you're here, like look at that view, like, oh, that's amazing, like, it's a really good view, like, it's great. But yeah, this, with this being done, this is actually it. This is the, this is the end. <gasps> now the time has come to face the final curtain. We haven't even got curtains. <laughs> you get one of those banners that, um, one of the, like, the, um, like, red banners that we had. And just have it, like, up here, like, coming down. Um... That's a thing. Um, but yeah, that's, that's, we're kind of done with this. And this has been an interesting journey because I did film quite a lot of this kind of, I, I filmed it a lot in one go because I didn't know how the building would turn out and if I could build um, all of this in the time frame that I wanted to like export it. Like with the, with the next like, Minecraft um, build series, like I'm going to be building it actively while the videos are coming out because um, then I can get like hints and tips, like one of the comments um, for this video um, was, oh you can also see a little bit of the work I've been doing outside, <laughs> show you this in a second, um, one of the, one of the um, things was that I've been making this in the pansexual colours so, um, not the pansexual, asexual colours. So, this is actually now called the Aces Theatre. <laughs> um, I'm thinking about like trying to make a like a banner to put on the on the front. And I I haven't actually done the um, the naming of the, the things, but I will come back and do that. I've just been doing other things as well, like in the background. I've I've been wanting to put this in the in the landscape. Um, so let's have a little look at that. But for but right now, like this is like this theater is done. Like got little bits of niggles, like we have to do like 
the 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 sign that would go in that little space there for the um, for those posters and, and name like the Sweeney Todd shows that's going in. But like as you can see, I I love playing Minecraft and I've just been like building uh, bits and pieces in the background. So this connects all the way to um, like through here. You can get on the rails here. <laughs> um, all the way to like where our where our name is, which I've moved because I've been playing around in that area as well. Um, I've been playing a little bit on Twitch um, as well. So come come see me on Twitch if that's something you'd like to see. Bunnies, bunnies, and yeah. So this is like the little area over here. We've, like this is a little bit of what we did in the in Twitch stream. Obviously, that was a little hell, so we didn't get very far. But like this is. What are you still doing here? Yeah, I moved my chair, it was over there, and I put it over here. That's my talkie chair. Um, but as you can see from the map room, with the bunnies, <laughs> like we've been doing quite a lot of stuff, and there's there's more things planned, which I'll talk about right now. Um, so, I, I've decided that I'm going to do uh, like a Minecraft Let's Build like once a week, as opposed to twice a week. One, so I can get more stuff in. So I've I've been working in the background to make Minecraft, uh, your Minecraft viewing uh, experience better. So we have Optify now. Ha ha. We also have a second account, um, which I can use. And I've been planning stuff in the background. Um, and I think with releasing it once a week. Will make that uh, and your experience better because we can do bigger time lapses, especially with the second account. And um, I'm thinking about doing uh, like the Minecraft build on like I think Tuesday is a good day, um, and then actually, we might do a, uh, a Minecraft um, like survival experience on Friday. Because I really want to get into survival, because uh, I've never actually completed the survival part of the game. Like I've never reached the uh, uh, like the end. I've never fought the dragon. I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, we have plans for um, the build. Um, I've got a couple of plans. And I will go through some of them right now. So um, let's go go down here. So let's start with this era. For like because it was nice and sandy and there was just this kind of like this kind of slab, like this is a completely natural like flat plane. It reminds me of like the entrance to like like a Tutun Car Moon esque like pyramid. And I really want to build that. Like, um who is it that's doing the giant like pyramid on Hermitcraft? Um, right now I can't remember their name. Um, put that in the comments. Um, yeah, I kind of want to do that and uh, play around with like the Egyptian theme, like some really kind of like um, like gold stuff and that sort of thing. And uh, this area would be that. Like we can have like the entrance, the tomb here, or maybe a, like a, a little bit of a, a city here. Um, let me hear your thoughts on that. Um, over here is going to be the um, my studio. So I'm going to be making like a, a, a like a film studio. Because we've done we've done um, we've done the theatre and now we're on to film. I'm, a, <laughs> I'm an actor, what do you want? Um, sometimes. Um, and I'm making a studio uh, for film. I'm, I came with this idea the other day because I was watching like um, Indiana Jones and I kind of wanted to create some of the sets from Indiana Jones and I thought oh, I could put that on a studio set. Um, so in this space I'm going to be making like um, like like sets from like fav like movies and some of them will be mine. But some of them will be yours. So tell me what your favourite movie is, and I will build the set if I can find like 
imagery and reference from it. Um, so that's that. <laughs> that's a that's a thing. Um, there's an, also another idea which I have, which is still in the in the leisure recreation area. And to show you that, like I I designed this bridge which connects all this, and it would actually be on the opposite side from where our theatre is. But to show you my ideas, I'm going to have to take you into my testing world. <gasps> Ooh, testing world. So, um, I was thinking about like a museum. And museums are boring, like especially in Minecraft. Like, what am I going to do? Build a sculpture? Yes, I am going to build a sculpture. But I'm going to be building sculptures of optical illusions. Let's get that in the right place. So yeah, so various places you'd be able to like come across like rooms that would look like this, which do the optical illusion, like that's you know, just me ever slightly lately. <laughs> Doing a, a, a 3D optical illusion in Minecraft. Mm, it's about there. It's like that's still a little bit dodgy, especially if I zoom in. But you get the idea, like like this is the, the classic um Escher painting. Like with the, the various kind of um like stairwells and I guess you can see there, like that stairwell is obviously going that way, um, but then you've got a stairwell going um, like that way on that plane, like going up there, and then getting to like that, and then being able to come back down here, and then using that staircase back. Mm, it's a bit like trippy, and I I really love that. So I've been playing. With some of these ideas, so like there, like that's the like the um like the the like ever going up staircase, which is in like Inception. Like they do a lot better at job in Inception, but you get what I mean. So that's that would be the other idea. So we've got the studio, we've got like the Egyptian section, and we've got like this museum. So if you like any of those ideas, let me know. And next, next Tuesday, I will have the first episode up. Yeah, so tell me what you think. But this has been the Alligator Minecraft build of the theatre. And I hope you've enjoyed it. So until next time. Guys, gals, and non-binary pals, this is Alligator. So see you later, Alligator, and a wild crocodile. Ladies! I end an episode not on my chair. <laughs> this feels weird.